Hi, my name is uh, Specialist Benjamin Ziegler. I'm standing here at the uh, Ed Center and Camp Humphreys, where uh, they helped me uh, raise my GT score up. I was at a 96, and I didn't think I could get any higher, and I went up to a 115 because the staff here, the uh, counselors, the people, they're all great. They work with you, and they uh, help you get where you need to go. Twenty years ago, I joined the military, you know, I don't know what the reason you guys joined, but you know, by that time, I don't know what's trending now, everybody was joining the military for money for college. And that is my number one reason to join. And that when I joined, my intention is to do four years and get out of my, you know, GI Bill and all that. So when I joined, I'm an infantry guy uh, by MOS and my Squad leader was telling me, oh, as an infantry guy, oh, you won't have time to go to school. It's too difficult. We're going to be going to fields and all that kind of stuff. And I'm so stubborn. I'm born in April and the Taurus. I hate when somebody tells me I can do something. From then on till right now, I have an associate degree, a two bachelor's degree, one in accounting and one in business administration, and I have a dual master's degree in organization leadership and human resources management. So don't let anybody tell you you can't do it. Down the road, I do actually want to get accepted into the doctor, doctoral physical therapy program through the Army and work as a physical therapist with the United States Army. So I do want to do that. And I also want to start my own mentor program for girls so I can help girls like just figure out their life, help them out, um, just teach them the things that I had to learn along the way so they won't make mistakes. Or if they do make mistakes, they know that they can always move forward from their mistakes, so. The young soldiers, the advice I could give them is, you know, is, you know, you may not want to go and do it because it's school, you know, or you don't think you can do it. Just go there, talk to them, and they'll take care of the rest. They'll, put, they'll point you in the right direction. It's not as bad as you think it is. It's not as hard as you think it is. And you might surprise yourself. The advice I have is to utilize the resources around you. I know some people, a lot of young soldiers uh, joined the military because they had nothing else they wanted to do, but there's so many opportunities with the military and I just feel like you can utilize what's around you. So just think about what you want to do, what you see yourself doing, and if it is just um, staying in the military, always look into education and just expanding that because if something happened where you can't remain in the military, at least you'll have an education to fall back on. So just utilize what's around you. Always get educated, whether it's in a trade, whether it's art, whether it's medical, anything, but just have something that no one can take away from you. And I feel like education is something that no one can take away from you. 